Hi guys, it's Kiki Love 221, and today I'm going to show you how to make a washing machine for your American Girl dolls. So, you're gonna need, well, I've already made my washing machine, so I'm just gonna review the steps with you guys so you can make your own for your American Girl doll because she needs clean clothes. So, um, you're just gonna take a box, and so when you turn the box um, so that the flaps are um, standing up, it has to be about the size of a washing machine to a human. So like about how big a washing machine to a human is except for the box for the American doll. This one is a little small, but that's okay too. So so when your box is down, there's gonna be like um flaps to open the box. So what you want to do is cut off the side flaps. You want the long flaps to stay, but you want to cut off the side flaps. And so when you're done cutting off the side flaps, you glue you can tape the big flaps together so that it looks like a box. And you want to do the same thing to the other side. And then so, just tape it. Don't like tape the whole thing yet. So then, when you turn them to the top, it's all it's gonna be all box. So then you just want to cut out a square on the top. You don't want it too big and you don't want it too small because a washing machine's flap isn't big or small. And so, um, um. Then, what you want to do is cut out this tiny little square so that when you close it, you're able to open it. Because if, if you didn't have that little opening, then it'd be really hard to open your washing machine. So, you just want that to be there, okay? So then, you're just going to hold up the flap like this, and you're going to tape it all around. I use brown tape, but you can use, like, white tape or black tape or just regular tape. But in the house, all I had was this kind of tape clear tape but I didn't want to use clear so you can use whatever color tape you want I preferably white because lots of washing machines are white but um so then you're just going to tape around it just like take the roll of tape and just go go around it like that and so then at this point you can tape the whole washing machine and then you just want to fold this tape over in there and then just tape all around the whole entire washing machine I would suggest you keep the tape going in one direction so that it would look nicer. But then, when you're done taping the whole washing machine, you can take one of the flaps that you had cut off in the beginning and you can write buttons on them and tape them there so it'll look like that. Except the tape that I put there is like starting to like not be sticky anymore, not holding. So you can just tape it like that and like that. Just tape it down. And then, for the best part, which is the detailed part, it's for the inside. You want to take a plastic cup because any other cup would just make the washing machine heavy and kind of big and stuff. But you want to take a cup that you won't use anymore. I would suggest using a plastic cup. And then put it upside down and tape it to the middle of the box in the bottom. So it's like the washing machine that has the, the, um, the, what is it called? The... <laughs> rod thing, not a rod, um, the cylinder thing that spins so that the clothes can go around and wash. And so, you just do that and you tape that in the middle. Yeah. So just tape it down. And so then, you know you want your American Girl doll to have clothes in her washing machine. You don't want it to be an empty washing machine all the time. So, I know some people don't want to put actual American Girl doll clothes into the washing machine. So you could just take a pair of like clothes that you won't that you don't wear anymore or something like that. Like clothes that isn't necessary anymore that you don't wear or like and I just have these pajama shorts that I've never worn and maybe plan on wearing some other time not anytime soon. And so what you can do is hold on. You can take the clothes and just put it around the washing machine so kind of like that but you want to put it around the cylinder so just around and just keep going around until it looks full like that so it looks like your clothes like your American Girl dolls washing clothes so now let's compare it to Molly okay.
Sorry about this, guys. Stand up, please, Molly, please. Please stand up. Molly, please stand up. Molly, stand up, thank you. Okay, Molly decided she wants to stand up and be on camera. So that's Molly. It's about up to her, say, lower hip. Like, right there. And so, um, it's a little small. It could have been, like, right up here-ish. Which is about an inch higher than where it is now. But it's okay. She could have, like, a small washing machine. So, yeah. And that's my American Girl Doll washing machine. Thanks for watching. Comment and please subscribe. Bye.